Good day everyone, I'm Mirjan Maynard Casilla to report about reasons for studying concepts of programming languages. Number one, increased ability to express ideas. It is widely believed that the depth at which people can think is influenced by the expressive power of the language in which they communicate their thoughts. Those with only a weak understanding of natural language are limited in the complexity of their thoughts, particularly in depth of abstraction. In other words, it is difficult for people to conceptualize structures they cannot describe, verbally or in writing. The language in which they develop super places limits on the kinds of control structures, data structures, and abstractions they can use. Thus, the form of algorithms they can construct are likewise limited. Awareness of a wider variety of programming language features can reduce such limitation in software development. Programmers can increase the range of their software development, though processes, by learning new language constructs. It might be argued that learning the capabilities of other languages does not help a programmer who is forced to use a language that lacks those capabilities. The argument does not hold up, however, because often language constructs can be simulated in other languages that do not support those constructs directly. Number two. Improved background for choosing appropriate languages. Many professional programmers have had little formal education in computer science. Rather, they have developed their programming skills independently or through in-house training programs. Such training programs often limit instruction to one or two languages that are directly relevant to the current projects of the organization. Many other programmers received their formal training years ago. The languages they learned then are no longer used, and many features now available in programming languages were not widely known at the time. The result is that many programmers, when given a choice of languages for a new project, use the language with which they are most familiar, familiar even if it is poorly suited for the project at hand. If these programmers were familiar with a wider range of language and language constructs, they will be better able to choose the language with the features that best address the problem. Number three, greater ability to learn new languages. Computer programming is still a relatively young discipline, and design, methodologies, software development tools, and programming languages are still in a state of continuous evolution. This makes software development an exciting profession, but it also means that continuous learning is essential. Once a thorough understanding of a fundamental concepts of a language is acquired, it becomes far easier to see how these concepts are incorporated into the design of the language being learned. For example, programmers who understand the concepts of object-oriented programming will have the much easier time learning Java than those who have never used those concepts. Number four, understand significance of implementation. In learning the concepts of programming languages, it is both interesting and necessary to touch on the implementation issues that affect those concepts. In some cases, an, an understanding of implementation issues leads to an understanding of why languages are designed the way they are. In turn, this, acknowledge, this knowledge leads to the ability to use a language more intelligently at is was designed to be used. We can become better programmers by understanding the choices among programming language constructs and the consequences of those choices. Number five, better use of languages that are already known. Many contemporary programming languages are large and complex. Accordingly, it is uncommon for a programmer to be familiar with and use all of the features of a language he or she uses studying the concept of programming languages. Programmers can learn about previously known and unused parts of the languages they already use and begin to use those features. Number six, overall advancement of computing. Finally, there is a global view of computing that can justify the study of programming language concepts. Although it is usually possible to determine why a particular programming language become popular, Many believe, at least in retrospect, that the most popular languages are not always the best available. In some cases, it might be included that a language became widely used, at least in part, because those in position to choose languages were not sufficiently familiar with programming language concepts.
For example, many believe that Algol 60 was a better language than Fortran. However, Fortran was most widely used. It is attributed to the fact that the programmers and managers didn't understand the conceptual design of Algol 60. And so, that's all for today. Thank you.